Hi everyone, this is Professor N. And this is Professor M. We've recently expanded beyond quantum mechanics and started doing videos on maths, the first few on differential equations, and I hope you've been enjoying them. But we've also been busy with other stuff, and we want to share that with you today. For a while now, we haven't been able to dedicate the time that we would love to be able to spend creating all of the Professor M content. And that's just because we have tons of things to do with our university hats on. We both lead research groups and that keeps us really busy. And we've been trying to think of ways that we could make the channel sustainable and continue to deliver this content regularly and really more generally provide more value for all of you. And this is why we've decided to launch something really new and we hope very exciting. We're going to share problems and solutions to go with the videos. Dozens of problems and really lengthy solutions They'll... in gory detail. You'll be able to find them on our website, link below, for a small fee, and we hope that this will make the channel sustainable and we'll be able to publish videos more regularly. We also think this is going to be a really key part of your learning journey. Problems are really essential when you learn something new in maths and in physics. And in a way, we were missing that in what we were creating so far. We were just giving you definitions and proofs, but we were not really giving you the space to say, okay, I'm gonna go and try it myself at my own pace. And what we're giving you here is tens and tens of problems with really detailed solutions that you will be able to follow line by line, step by step. And they follow very much the same philosophy as the videos, which is, you do not skip any steps, you make everything really explicit, and I can promise you that after going through all of our problems, you're gonna be extremely confident with all of these concepts in quantum mechanics, and you should be able to ace any exam uh, or anything really that, you, that you're trying to achieve with your learning. We already have the first batch of problems out. They cover the harmonic oscillator, and we look at things like a harmonic oscillator in an electric field, coupled harmonic oscillators, and many more. And that's it. Let us know what you think. We look forward to seeing many completed problem sets. And thank you again so much for your support. See you all very soon.